Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Coming back to you with another Theta Chain slash informative crypto video. I want you to hit that like, subscribe, notification bell so we get this video out into the algorithm. Remember, the more eyes that are on my channel puts more eyes on Theta Chain as well as the other crypto informative content that I create. All right. So if we look at Theta Chain right now, we are going down in price action now for the first time in uh, maybe a week or so, we are saying that all of the main numbers are in the red. Okay, now we really, we rarely see this right here. We got say the chain uh, that is down nine percent. We also have the market cap that is down nine percent. Also, okay, we're out of the fifties already. Uh, so, <clears throat> okay, bear with me. And we have the volume, which is back into the one hundred k's, down twenty four percent. And I think it has a lot more to do with the market. Okay, let's just see if the market is down. The market is down. See, the market is down 4%. And we may be going into a crypto trend here, y'all. Okay, we see that the market is down 4%. Uh, we have at 1.52 trillion. Okay, so that explains a lot. And let's look over here. The fear and greed index is in neutral, right in the middle. Okay, a little bit behind the middle. Okay, at 49 in the neutral. Okay, so we're going right now into a fear state. Now, what is driving a fear state? It may just be what's going on on Capitol Hill because you know that they're amping up more on, um, you know, the regulations. You know, a lot of things are going on with these court cases and all of that. We had the you know, the, the Bitcoin ETF and all of that stuff. So, uh, you know, still have a lot of stuff going on with Coinbase and uh, XRP that is on Capitol Hill. So a lot of things that are going on right now that are driving the market and it is infecting, affecting the crypto, okay, that you are investing in, okay, including, say, the chain. We can see that the Bitcoin is, hey, far cry from that 50K that we've seen. All right, so when we look at say the chain, there's nothing wrong with the numbers right here. It's moving with the market. Uh, say the chain has already had, okay, uh, you know, its moments where it was able to move on its own uh, ahead of the market. But right now it's falling in line. It's like one of those regular blue collar cryptos right now. It's becoming a household name. And that's what you want to see, okay, uh, when it comes to, uh, you know, projects like say the chain. OK, that you are investing in. You want those to become household names. All right. Because when it becomes a household name, it does what? It puts eyes uh, of the masses. The masses eyes are now on that project. OK. And the masses are like, what is this? OK. Remember what I say, y'all. The masses only know uh, or what they only invest in what they know and what they see. All right. So just like you have the masses out here right now. They're investing into what? A lot of Bitcoin. They're investing into a lot of, um, you know, cliche stuff like uh, Ethereum. They're investing into a lot of Cardano. They're investing into a lot of uh, XRP, of course, XRP. So the more say the chain gets out there and it moves closer and closer to the mainstream, all right, uh, the better it is for the project. We're going to have more of that uh, revenue, okay, flowing into. Uh, we're going to have more of that revenue flowing into the project, okay? And then it's just going to become a domino effect. Um, and that's just say the chain, okay? Now, just imagine when a lot of the utility get uh, further out there. Imagine when something like uh, say the realty gets further out into the real estate space, okay? Imagine say the realty becoming a household name in the real estate uh, space. Why will it become a household name? Because it's the first ever project to bridge or attempting to bridge crypto and real estate okay so when you think about if you're a real estate agent or you're a real estate investor entrepreneur whatever it may be whatever sector you're in okay within the real estate space okay and then you think about crypto you're going to think about say the realty all right when it comes to say the realty that is the bridge okay that's going to connect uh the real estate all right, now also think about logistics. Say the logistics. Say the logistics will become a household name because, uh, you know, say the logistics will cater to uh, logistics and uh, payment systems. Okay, and now we're talking about ground, air, okay, uh, by boat. All right, every way that a logistics can travel, okay, um, uh, you know, say the logistics, if it becomes a household name, will be connected to them. When you think about 
uh, 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 you know, crypto in the logistics space, you want to think about SATA Logistics. Why? Because SATA uh, Logistics is the first utility under the SATA chain umbrella, okay, that will bridge uh, logistics and crypto uh, together. Okay. So that's why I like these uh, uh, the utilities. That is why I like those to become a household name. And believe it or not, these two utilities right here, it will carry, okay, uh, uh, say the chain a long way. All right. It's going to carry the brand name a long way. Uh, and the thing is, when we think about brand names and all of that stuff, we think more about say the chain. Okay. The say the chain is going to carry the utility. But I'm here to tell you right now, it's going to work both ways. But what I'm going to tell you is that uh, if all goes to plan, okay, if all falls according to plan, okay, uh, it's uh, look, the utility is going to more so be carrying the SATA uh, <clears throat> chain name, all right, because we're talking about the utilities. In my opinion, the utility is going to get way more exposure uh, first because of the sectors that it is in. Say the chain is going to get this um, this name out there too, but I believe that the utilities. Look, I'm gonna just say it like this: the individuals that are in the logistics sector, uh, and the individuals that are in the real estate sector, they're gonna learn more about. Um, they're gonna learn more about the Sailor Logistics name and the Sailor Realty name first, okay, before they fully comprehend the. Uh, the mother father name which is uh say the chain okay and that's because say the i mean logistics and real estate is just out there i mean it's worldwide so i like that y'all and uh those are going to be two of the most important utilities this is why i said to say the chain is a cornerstone like you know i got a lot of slack from that too i got a lot of slack from uh a couple years back when i first started saying it that Say to say Tama, which was say Tama at the time. I said it's going to get, it's going to become a cornerstone of crypto, and people bash me for that. They say, how can you say that? It's not legendary like, um, like Bitcoin. It's not legendary like Ethereum, all of that stuff. Uh, but I told y'all, what makes a, a crypto legendary is the value that crypto can add to the crypto space that is different from what uh, another cornerstone crypto has already did. Like in my opinion, I think that. Uh, you know, and I hate really saying that because you know how I feel about the meme space, but I mean, uh, Doge is, is, is kind of legendary, okay? But what is more legendary than Doge? Uh, what's more legendary than Doge would be a uh, she, okay? Because she, Doge represented, um, uh, presented the meme space to crypto, it was the first time crypto had a meme space, and then, uh, uh, you know. She came along and revolutionized the um, and revolutionized the meme space. All right, when you think about uh, contracts, smart contracts, and all of that stuff. Okay, a lot of individuals they were talking a lot about Ethereum. Okay, they were talking a lot about Ethereum and its technology was smart uh, connected to smart contracts and all of that stuff. All right. Um, and then what comes along? Then you have something like Cardano comes along and change the game with, with smart contracts. I mean, before, um, you know, Ethereum, you have Bitcoin. Bitcoin is legendary. And then you had Ethereum come along with the smart contracts. And then you have, uh, and then you have, uh, you know, ADA come along or Cardano come along and revolutionize that. So not all cryptos are cornerstone, but there are a handful of exceptional cornerstone cryptos in the world. And I believe that, say, the chain uh, is a major cornerstone when it comes to uh, crypto. Why? Because it's the first crypto that's going to connect uh, anything from the outside world, uh, which is real estate and which is logistics, is going to connect it to crypto. How can that not be legendary? Because no other crypto is doing that. All right? No other developer is doing that. Say the chain not only um, you know is connecting those two industries and those sectors to crypto. But at the same time, they're building a blueprint for other future investors and developers to come along and do the same thing. All right. So let's just say 10 years from now, we're going to have what? Goddamn, maybe, I don't know, a handful of developers, maybe 10, 20, who knows, of developers full of blue collar cryptos that are connecting all these sectors, including real estate and logistics to 
uh, 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 crypto. And people are going to always look back and say, hey, say the chain started that movement. And then who know how how far around that time, say the chain is going to be the move to the next uh, sector of his, um, <clears throat> the next sector. All right. Um, so who knows how far advanced ahead that say the chain is going to be. OK, when all of these new trends that uh, that are following this, this new blueprint comes about, who knows how far advanced this project is going to be. All right. And even if this project was to fall off, uh, you know, down the road or pass down to another, um, you know, developer or whatever, whatever the future holds, regardless of what happens to this project, it's going to be this project that started it all, revolutionizing crypto. OK. So for individuals that want to bash and say, ah, you, you, you know, you're delusional. No. OK. If a crypto like Seda Chain introduces um real estate and if it, it introduces logistics to crypto and bridge both of those uh sectors that's legendary that is how say the chain will revolutionize crypto now if you can't understand that i don't know what else to tell you all right so once again before i get out of here <clears throat> i'm going to tell you again how say the chain is going to be legendary it's going to be legendary because it is bridging logistics, which is worldwide, and it is bridging real estate, which is worldwide, which is what you're sitting in right now inside your home, your building, your work, whatever you is on your laptop or your phone listening to me right now. It's going to build that worldwide, and it's going to connect that, okay, to crypto. No other crypto in the crypto space out of almost 4,000 cryptos is doing that. One crypto. That right there, my friends, is legendary. This is my video. Remember, every now will be history tomorrow. You either have patience in this crypto investing space or lose in the end. And the thing is, you beautiful people out there do not want to be losers. It's my video, and I will catch all of you on the up and up. Audi.